Hey guys, it's Haji here, back with another Cosmic Crucible video. It's uh, round three, round three. We've got Tony. Fuck you, Tony! Tony's sitting at 30 million TCP, so right around me again. And then I'm sitting at 29.5. He hasn't seen any of my videos here. Um, so yeah, let's get it going. If anyone here has seen my, video, seen my videos, you'll know that I've been struggling in season three, big time. Uh, at the time of recording this, today I actually just completely revamped my offense and my defense to change things up. I, I put Spider Weaver on offense. I, I changed a lot, so in future videos there's going to be some big changes for that to see if we can we can switch it up here. Um, but first attack, we're going to do New Warriors Eternals. I'm still missing a T4 on Firestar to get the trauma on Icarus and Cersei. However, Gotta try it, right? This is what we built them for, so... Gotta try. Get that special out there with the... Uh, Gwenpool. Ultimate there. I think we're supposed to do the special if you don't have the T4, but I'm not sure. Get the ultimate out there. Pretty sure I placed it on Icarus just to get that uh, vulnerable on him. Failed? Do I not? I didn't check it. Do I not have Skirmisher on my cloak? What the heck happened there? And this is where it just goes terrible. And I'm, I'm, correct, correct me if I'm wrong, but I do think it's that T4 on Firestar. Because I've got all the accuracy T4s. I've got all the T4s on Gwenpool, and I think it's just Icarus and Cersei flipping buffs, getting speed up, killing speed bar, and going to town. So, 200 more orange ability materials, and I've got the salt. Then again, I just, at the time of recording this video, just put Spider Weaver on offense, so as if it's going to even matter. We got a nice deletion of Spider Weaver there, so I can come in and clean this up better than the previous videos where I didn't even get the clear. The last the last match, I had Cersei at maybe two health and timed out, so we're looking a lot better this time, that's for sure. for them to mess me up here. Get it over with. Salt in the wound. All right. I usually, whenever I have a cleanup, I do like to save them until the end. Let's go for this unlimited here. If I'm being honest, I never what uh, Jesus, I can't speak. I never remember what happens in my crucibles ever. I usually get to filming and recording this about a week later. Um, just life is busy, so I, I don't get to it in time, and I, I never remember what happens. Or I think I remember what happens when I start quoting the wrong crucible. I think as I stream more and get more used to this job and hobby that I'll, I'll get better as time goes on and hopefully the quality can get better for you guys as well let's get that turn meter rewind on the rogue and i will start doing live face videos as well um, my issue currently is my computer cannot support blue stacks to the point where i can record uh smoothly like it's 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 really bad so i have to do everything on my phone um Give it time, guys. I promise you, I'm gonna start doing everything properly here. Get the channel up to a nice quality. And uh, let's see if Kang can wipe these guys. Damn close, that's for sure. Phantomax has been kind of proving some people wrong lately. He's been doing well. Like, I've been noticing him 
in a few different videos, not of my own. Making a difference in some fights. Oh, everything just goes south here. Everything. That was just terrible. Fixed her up. Ultimate from Dormammu always solves the solves your issue, right? Let's take out that rogue. Better to be safe than sorry. Get rid of the most lethal character. Let's take out let's take out Sunfire. There we go. I was gonna say take out Sunfire, dummy. I don't push insanely hard for efficiency. Why? Because I've got absolutely destroyed for it before, so play it smart. Also, I use Masters of Evil there because that is a lower war dog, like a weaker war dog, so I know for a fact I can take it with Gamma or Dark Hold. Just for, for your information there, I didn't want to mess around with that unlimited X-Men. Um, and I hate to keep talking about the future, but I also am going to try out that S.A. Kestrel Dormammu team on unlimited X-Men next to my seat. So that'll be coming up in the future for future videos as well. I got to make it work somehow, right? Oh, building momentum and I'm rocking Apocalypse, Jesus. I realized though I could have stunned the Red Hulk with that, I just didn't think it through. Steal 35% of her health. Try and get rid of her so she doesn't throw anything back at me here. She's terrible. I got Red Hulk as Skirmisher, or not Red Hulk, She-Hulk, so remove the death proof there. That's a really bad time to have that empowered basic. Maybe I should have just taken out She-Hulk? I don't know. Oh, here we go, no. Now I can take her out. Issue is though, now that Red Hulk's gonna, gonna ult on me here. Right after a bomb's giving me defense down. How unlucky is that? Oh, Jesus Christ, my soul. That hurts. I think I actually have to force quit out of this because there's no, there's no coming back from that. Another future thing, because I'm learning from my mistakes. Guess who's on Gamma now, or guess who's on defense now? I spoiled it, it's Gamma. That's not who I meant to click. There we go. Could you imagine bringing in Death Seed against Gamma? Say goodnight. Yeah, they're blinded for the first turn, and so the, the match carries on, but you're not doing shit to them. Cakewalk here. Boom! What are you guys gonna do about that? Cassie, if you watch my videos, hello. I miss you.
for anyone listening, Tassie's my little sister, and she's probably the, the sweetest little girl in the world. Ultimate with Gambit. Special with Rogue and Stella D. Probably time to take out that war dogs now, I would say. Nope, time for rebirth instead. I don't know why it never works here. Clearing the revive once on these characters. I got it off of Baby Venom, but like, I think I said this in the last. For this specific reason, in order to clear them. I don't understand why it's not working. No stun there, but it's okay. Yeah, you're not landing anything on my seven red. Friggin' Hulk, that's 330,000 power. Good luck with that. Peel off the taunt just to put it back on. This fight is terrible, but it always works. So, if I got Gamma left, Gamma's going in. Mr. Agent Venom. I just took him to level 95. He is beefy. He's a big boy now. But I think I only have him like 4 red or 5 red, so he's still a little smaller. He's in the 200 still, but to like 200,000 power, but he's got some work to, some room for growth. And now we can watch Rebirth burn. Completely off topic as well. I was going to do content on uh, Lord of the Rings, Here's a Middle Earth. What content? What gameplay? I'm I'm getting so ready to quit that game because maybe just temporarily quit. Like there's nothing to do. It's wasting my time. There's no excitement to it whatsoever. It gets like if you took bland, dry bread and served it to somebody, that's what Lord of the Rings Heroes of Middle-earth is currently. And I don't remember which content creator stated it, but it's a game that's that's still pre-launch. Like, it's still a beta game that was launched too soon. They likely needed money. I bet you they... Well, I guess with capital games, they should have massive money stores, but you know how it goes. Kill order was completely wrong this match, but it didn't matter. Death Seed on Death Seed. One of the easiest matchups you can get. Ah, that's not true. I'd say like sometime, like 5% of the time it, it can go south. I'm not sure what the make or break point is, but there's something that makes it go south. Not including the turns you use. Like I just mean like the RNG and how it plays out. Because obviously you have to use the special lift. So I know if you use the ultimate, it cannot work. I'm talking if you use the special still on Archangel. It's 
That's probably the most important thing right there. Getting that turn meter rewind on Psylocke. If their Psylocke can send all the debuffs back to you, they can win. Take away all of his positive effects with that Dark Beast and Wood Knight. I like Death Seed. Death Seed is, like, I know they're the weakest horsemen team, but they're a fun team. Like, I enjoy playing with them often. Yeah, it's, this is another one just like the Gamma on Rebirth fight. It's not the most efficient. But it's gonna get the job done. It's a 500,000 power punch down, so it's gonna work. And if it doesn't work, something's wrong. I brought my war dogs to uh, 1.5, or not 1.5, Jesus, 1.05 mil. And um, I'm wondering if it was a mistake or not. Like, they're useful, but, like, there's always an answer to take them out. And I don't find them that useful in war offense. Like, yeah, they're, they're, they're pretty good, but I don't know. I don't find them to be, like, an apex meta team. I just find them to be a meta team. Like a good 8.5 out of 10. Take out Nokia because she's slept on. People don't understand her value. Not that it mattered. I don't know why I waited that option for so long. It was only one positive slash negative effect difference. Um, and he gone. Hella, Silver, our Zombie Iron Man. Did I do this differently? Yeah, I went for speed. Utilize that ability block to make sure that I don't get I'd say spread him, but he has immunity, so not doing much against her there. Don't give up yet, don't give up yet. Remember, their ultimates are wasted, and I got two Gregs. Two Gregs, unstoppable. Two Gregs can take on Thanos, if you guys didn't know. In real life, not in the not in the game. I 
I've been debating bringing my Hela in Zombie Iron Man to level 90, but I just don't think they have enough potential. Like, they're half in the meta, half out of the meta, and they're not going to stay in the meta, so I don't, I don't know. I guess they might because of her speed, but she's not quite as good as Emma, in my opinion, for that, for that objective or that goal. That's it for the Crucible, guys. I really hope you enjoyed it. Leave a like, leave a comment, subscribe. Have a good day, and I'll see you in the next one.